<laughs> uh, second topic is um, one we touched on a couple of times before. Uh, it's about, as he said, uh, no, no, <laughs> no, 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 Clark has popped up again in the news. And um, because he's been clear, well, no, because the police will not um, investigate further because they're saying that it doesn't meet the threshold for their investigating. He is now saying that he's lost everything uh, to cancel culture and that um, cancel, modern cancel culture is akin to modern uh, McCarthyism. Like, he's really putting himself there as a martyr, isn't he? Uh, modern well, McCarthyism. Well, let's see what he says. Anyway, this, this comes to us via Deadline. And uh, just waiting for this article to load up. Yes. So the, the I want to read the, big, the, the, the title of the article. I lost everything. Noel Clark likens cancel culture to modern McCarthyism after UK police cease sexual harassment investigation. British actor producer Noel Clark has spoken out uh, for the first time since the Metropolitan Police announced that none of the allegations of being a sexual predator and bully made against the double BAFTA winner met the threshold for further police inquiry and that they would be ceasing to investigate him. Clark, who saw a catalogue of projects cancelled in the light of the allegations made against him and the closure of his production company, told the Daily Mail, there has been no arrest, no charges, no trial, no verdict, but I've been criminalised. This is a form of modern McCarthyism. He said, if we don't need uh, police and judges and juries anymore, if we only need social media and the broadcasters, then what world do we live in? At what point do the broadcasters in this country become the judges, juries and executioners of people? At what point did BAFTA decide they were no longer about films, but they were about judging people's lives? This is not about me. It's bigger. It's about due process. Yes, people have said these things about me. Um... But I say you are a donkey. It doesn't make you... But if I say you're a donkey, it doesn't make you a donkey, does it? His comments come after BAFTA suspended his membership and withdrew his award to, uh, its award to him for outstanding achievement in the British film industry following the publication of the allegations in the Guardian newspaper. The complaints were made by more than 20 women and spanned a 15-year period with claims including unwanted touching groping, inappropriate behaviour and the covert filming of a naked audition. Clark has always denied all allegations made against him. He is now suing BAFTA and The Guardian for defamation. He is also suing magazine publisher Condé Nast, which ran a piece about the controversy in its GQ magazine. Uh, 20 years of work got, is gone in 24 hours, Clark told the mail. I lost everything. The company I built from the ground up, my, chief, my TV shows, my movies, my book deals, the industry respect I had in my heart and in my head, it has damaged me in a way I cannot articulate. Looking ahead, he, want, he says he wants the film and TV industry to create a framework where women and vulnerable people are protected, but which mm -hmm. also protects mm -hmm. people who may be thrown under the bus unjustly and where people can differentiate between an evil guy and someone who might have made a misstep. See that? that that's that, ominous. Mm. Clark adds that he can't see an easy way back to his career after being cancelled by BAFTA, broadcasters and production companies. None of them wants to be wrong. They made such big, bold statements. Then there's the current climate, the moment anyone speaks out or even says, hold on a second, um, what's the context? Society turns on them too. That's the end of the article. I just want to read a couple of comments from the article, right? Um, so there's a lot of people backing him saying, oh, you know, that one guy here, uh, one person, should I say, time for the armchair keyboard warriors, uh, brigade to throw their two cents obviously you know yeah. um we cannot decide people's guilt or innocence outside of the courtroom end of story that's another person um you know there was one that i really wanted uh, one that even says i believe him which yeah anyway um 
in the meantime, yeah, you, you, you I'm gonna up. go first. Speak up, go. So, I've I, I've not changed my stance on this, mm. but his guilt. I never found him guilty because of what I heard. Mm -hmm. I found him guilty for what he didn't do. Mm -hmm. His lack of. Mm. What, you disappeared. If you, we've said this before, if you haven't done anything, Noel, then face everyone. You're mm. Noel Clark. Well, let me just cut you there. So there was, a, there was something here. Worth remembering, when the news broke, his initial comment, and we've reported on this, mm. was something along the line of, they can't prove it. Not, I didn't do it. Not, I'm being framed. They can't prove it. Definitely something, someone who is 100% innocent says, obviously, that's sarcasm. Right. Going back so to what I said, mm. he, and that's part of it, mm. you hung yourself. All you had to do, yeah, if you believe what you're saying, mm. is say, I didn't. This never happened. Mm -hmm. I would have went on everybody's platform. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's, there's a variety of... Everyone would have had him on. Yeah. Everyone, even the people that wanted to try to hang him... They would have had him They on. would have had him on and he mm -hmm. would have said, this is not right. Mm -hmm. It's not happening. Mm -hmm. Didn't happen. Where are they then? Yeah. Go mm -hmm. and call them. Yeah. Mm. Then I'm I'm more inclined to believe you. But this, oh, oh well, I do need a little therapy and... It's, it's the little things that you said. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not... Be I can't believe people I don't know. Like, where are they? These people that made these accusations, they're nowhere to be seen, but you are. Mm. Well, you... apparently, there are some that are actually known act actresses. That no, are... but are, are they out saying it? Yes, yes, yes. Everywhere. Yes, mm. yes, yes. Because there's some names that there was mentioned in these in these comments that I'll go through in a bit. Okay, to... so so if I search them, yeah. they'll be there talking. Yeah. Yeah. Or, okay, but even still, where has he been? Wait, where? where? You're, no, you're no, hiding no. behind... News articles. Mm -hmm. mm. Who told you not to? Mm -hmm. Who told you not to? And why did they tell you not mm -hmm. to? Mm -hmm. Why did they say... I could have legal representation, but I am telling you, if I haven't done something, and you tell me, no, don't say anything, fuck all that. No. Mm -hmm. I'm yeah. telling everyone. Yeah. This is a I'm setup. Every... This is a frame. Yeah. I will start my own YouTube. Yeah. I will go on everyone's YouTube. Yeah. Mm. If that's the only thing I talk about every single day, that's what I'm doing. You're not mm -hmm. cancelling me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now, because there's no charges, so legally you're off. Mm. And he's like, whoo, got away with that one, but your career's in tatters. Yeah. Because mm. I don't think he believed that nothing would come of it. He mm. thought he was going to prison. Uh, if, well, at least caught. Yeah. If he yeah. knew this was the outcome, mm. he, he would have done that straight yeah, away. Right. But he wasn't sure. He mm. was like, oh, even in the article, misstep. Thank you. What are you talking about, Did misstep? You... What's a misstep? A mi oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, man. I, 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 missed, I fell over and grabbed your titty. Like, come on, man. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. In the terms of assault, what is a misstep? Bro. In in any sort of abuse, assault, you know, a punch uh, to slip to the puddle. Yeah, um, recording people without their no Where, where's the misstep? Where's the misstep? Mm. I don't understand. And, and you do you remember when he did finally bring out a statement? Yeah, and he said, oh, "I denied this." Blah 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 mm. blah. But then he said, "Oh, I will be seeking help." We seeking help. Oh, for? I got. I, I want to look for it just so I don't know. Oh, exact, see? the exact statement he brought out was. Reports have made it clear to me that some of my actions have affected people in ways I did not intend or realise. To those individuals, I am deeply sorry. I will be seeking professional help to educate myself and change for the better. Listen, that is so cryptic. What does that mean? You shouted at someone? You touched someone? You didn't touch someone? Bro, let me... What does let, that let, mean? Let me, let, me, let me just say this quickly, right? If it was a shouting at someone, Ting, you wouldn't need to bring that up. Well, okay. because, because they're talking about you... As, literally assaulting them, like mm. physically, sexually assaulting them. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Christian Bale so, shouted at someone in the film. Right, no, yeah. no right. <laughs> thank you. You don't see him, you don't see any other allegations mm. made against him or anything mm. like that. That would be the time to do it. Do you know mm. what I mean? Mm -hmm. But it was only that. And he's a, yeah, he's he's a bit of an arsehole on set. Everyone knows that, yeah. right? But he did. That's 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 is the, what it is. That's it, by the by. Right. Mm. So <laughs> for him bringing up, oh, um, if it was shouting. Which it wasn't because he yeah. wouldn't, he wouldn't have brought that up then. Mm. So he knows 
He's touched people inappropriate. Well, he's touched women inappropriately, and that's why he said what he said. But he's trying to downplay it. Yeah. Like you said, and like you said, there's no need to because you just brought up the statement. Mm. You wouldn't need to make statements like that. No. Like, what, what do you mean? Oh, I, 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 my, I've done stuff, and I need to uh, seek help for. What yeah. are you seeking help for? Like all the people that are backing him, what is he seeking help for then? Like, what, what, what is that statement about? And then on top of that, the statement that he made here, a misstep. Well, so, so what do, what, because we got to understand as well that his mind frame is not the same as an, our mind frame, maybe. Yeah, let's so, say our mind yeah, frame. Yeah, so, gonna... so I will kind of, a misstep is, oh, I tripped over. I'm mm -hmm. walking on the street. I tripped over. That's a misstep. Mm -hmm. To him, it might be, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. That's a misstep to him. Yeah. That's not a misstep to him. That's sexual assault yeah. to me yeah. and to hit these guys. Yeah, yeah, right yeah, now, yeah. to me, it definitely was. I'm getting <laughs> like, <laughs> So I don't, uh, yeah, anyway, anyway. Uh, yeah. Damien? I don't really have anything different to say on the matter. <laughs> um, I mean, just to, Literally echo both your points. And I when we originally reported on this, I was of the frame of mind that I want it to not be true. true. I mm. want it to be false. Uh -huh. Because of what what he stood for in terms of what he, he was pioneering the industry for UK kind of talent, uh -huh. you know, and what he was pushing. And when the story came out, I was like, ah, please, just let this be a Morgan Freeman, let this be a chasing after me, he's not done anything yeah. wrong. And the first thing, I remember when Morgan Freeman got called, he was like, I didn't do none of that. Straight, oh, away. No, straight away, straight I'm away. Sorry, what? No, I didn't do this. Straight away, and, and even then, the video that they tried to get him on, it was yeah, like, well, that, that, what "That's, that's what you're trying to get on." Yeah. yeah. But as the to Leon's point, it's like, and we've said this again, we've sung this from the fucking mountaintops. If I'm accused of something, I am on this morning, that morning, yeah, going to you. Guess what? I'm here. I didn't do it. Come get me, motherfucker. Yeah, but. You didn't do that. If I did, come and get me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, come, come and, and get, get me. me. I'm right Bring here. Every Bring every single now. person with the mother and your kettle of fish. I don't care. Mm -hmm. Bring your neighbour, the postman, the dog, your dog, dog. I just bring them. I don't care. It was I haven't done it. His behaviour. Right. His behaviour made him guilty. Right. Nothing else. Right. And also, people got to people who are supporting him. They got to realise he's had no support from the acting industry. Which actor, director, producer has stood up? And said, you know what? I stand with no clock. Even Bill Cosby had people backing him. Mm -hmm. Right? Even Bill fucking Cosby had people backing him. I've not seen... Have you seen anyone backing him from the acting industry? No, from what have, have you? I've only seen Pauline <laughs> backing him. <laughs> Pauline, where yeah, are where you? Where are you, Pauline? I dedicated a whole exactly. show to you. Exactly. And you did it right back. <laughs> and I, and I, I'm upset. Yeah. But, but, but the, do you know what I mean? I think people need to really look at things like... They're, they're, like we said about Kevin Spacey in our previous video, right? The mm. industry knows these things before they come out in the public eye. Mm -hmm. So, and you, we've got to remember also, there was the incident with Adam Deacon, which he's now been, been vindicated on, mm. that happened ages ago, mm. where he, he literally ruined that guy's career. Yeah. And got him sectioned, literally. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And that, How did he get cancelled? From right. him? Right. Mm. You mm. ruined one guy's life. Right. Why? Right. Why? Thank you. Why? But now you don't want it to happen to you. You done had the career. You got the money. Right. When you just tossed Adam Deacon aside and mm -hmm. he was the one that made kid adulthood yes. for you. Yes. Yes. Because you just look like some overgrown teenager mm -hmm. amongst them lot yeah, at yeah. the time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He actually looked like a teenager, Adam, Adam Deacon. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Adam sold that. Hundred percent, hundred percent. Well, he won. He won the uh, Rising Star, back yeah, the Rising yeah, Star, yeah. didn't he? For that, yeah. I mean, he done the little another hoard and yeah, this and that, yeah, and then yeah, yeah. he tried to blackball him. Exactly, anyway. exactly. So this is what I'm saying. Like, th there's a reason why no one in the industry has stood up for No Clock. There is a reason why, and that's what people need to see. Like, if you haven't, because I tell you this now, any one of us three was accused and. Please, Olaf, oh don't allow any of us to be accused of nonsense like that. But I know if any one of us was accused about something like that, there will be a whirl of people queuing up to stand up for us. Yeah, no, nah, they're not. Do you know what I mean? They're not. There, there, there'll be a whirl of people because they know that's not us. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Not one person in the industry, I'm being specific now, in the industry has stood up for no clock. So think on that when you want to talk about 
his innocence and trial and Maca mm. McCarthyism, really? You you, you want to compare yourself to all the people that were done for communism uh, in the 50s? Really? Mm. Really? Uh, I, all I'm going to say on this is that the rest that I'm going to say on, on that is, as I said to Leon when we spoke about this today, um, he's got two court cases going on, one with BAFTA, one mm. with Guardian. Mm. The BAFTA one, I'm not sure about, right? Mm. But I can tell you for now, from what I know about with the Guardian, Guardian and whatnot, yeah, yeah, yeah. he ain't winning that case. Mm. He, and in fact, that might backfire on him because then they might be able to look, come out with all the other stuff that they weren't allowed to write in the paper. And if the Sun can get depth, oh yeah, right now, then well, the they, that's a perfect analogy. Perfect analogy. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? If the Sun can win against Depp, you know what I mean? Yeah, Depp, Johnny, who's got infinitely more money than you have. <laughs> everyone super coming high profile protect. yeah super high profile and, and like Damien said everyone coming out to protect him because there's loads of people standing up for him yeah mm -hmm. yeah. you you have got no hope bro. Pretty, no no hope and, I, and I, I just hope that you just do the right thing bro I mean I, I, I know my opinion obviously my opinion don't mean shit and you know it's just my opinion but I believe that you were guilty of this it's my opinion but I think everything adds up. Do you know what I mean? And all the circumstances add up to you doing this. And listen, I still hope we're wrong. But that one thing that sticks with me is I need to get help for some of my behaviour. If you were vehemently denying it now, what help did you need before? And what was that help going right. towards? Right, and did you get the help? Because that's what you would say. Well, yeah, because mm. I'd like to know what help he got. Yeah, mm. what help did you get? What help did you get? You know what mm. I mean? Well, you forgot about that. Help. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't sound right. Because no, I'm going to get help. Remember, Pauline was like, "Oh, he shouted at some star." It ain't shouted. Listen, when someone Scarlets. you know what I mean? When someone accuses someone of sexually assaulting them, mm. that's not. It's not a shouting thing. It's that, not Christian Bale <laughs> trashed up a hotel room in central London with his mother and wife in the room mm. and went balls to wall on a DOP on set. Yeah. And he said, I got some anger issues. And you didn't hear anyone come out with, oh, he sexually assaulted me or this, that, and the other. No, that was just, that's exactly. And then you got the Bradley Cooper memes and that was it. Yeah. But, yeah. So, you know, at the end of the day, I, I, I believe these stories. And also, like I said, I've got, I've got previous experience with the Guardian newspaper investigating stories. Because so, I remember someone in our um, comments tried to say, oh, if Amber Heard can write an op-ed for the Washington Post, which is a reputable paper, because we were using re mm. reputable... Oh, then how can you use that not watching the trial? Because how can you then use that say because it's a reputable paper? That's co two completely different things, yeah? Mm. You've got one person writing an article for the paper, and then you've got another one who the paper itself investigated two different no there's, there's a difference there mm. you know what i mean but anything else guys mm, yeah you well, hung yourself bro you hung yourself there you go I, i'm not even I'm, not even mm. asher d not even ashley waters came just, out to, I'm, to I'm back just, you i'm just saying you, know I mean? you hung yourself bro. not even ashley waters you just you just you got my man show cancelled you know and he not even he's come out to back you so that that should say something and listen, I still hope some way that you get nothing. <laughs> <Boy. but> it, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys, what do you think about all this? Um, with not what No Clark is saying, do you think he's been bit by cancel culture? Um, and do you think there should be cancel culture in general? I mean, listen, not everyone can be convicted of a crime, but you, we know some people have done crimes that they weren't convicted of. And speaking from experience, the court systems. Oh, not not that great. Not that great. You know what I mean? So, you know, leave us some comments down below and let us know what you think.